Hello everyone, this is from Milwaukee to Nashville. I'm Daniel Goodwill. This is Christopher Draves. Hey. Um, as we uh, had put on our page earlier, um, both me and him are feeling under the weather. But we're going to still get this content out to you real quick. Um, this is the Admiral's eighth win in a row at home. And they are now 4-0 against San Antonio. San Antonio. Alright, the score was... Uh... Anthony Richard 2, San Antonio 1. <laughs> it's true, Richard's the only one that scored. So, first period, it was at 9-6, uh, shots on goal were 9-6, Milwaukee. Uh, second period, 10-8, San Antonio. And then the third period, they were even, 8 shots apiece. Uh, Milwaukee outshot them 25-24. Uh, power play, both teams were 0 for on the power play. Admirals were 0 for 3. San Antonio's 0 for 2. Uh, penalty minutes for San Antonio were 6 on 3 infractions. And Milwaukee had uh, 2 infractions for a total of 4 minutes. So outside of that, guys, stay out of the penalty box. Well, the refs just didn't feel like calling things. Most likely it was the refs not seeing things because the referees let a lot of cross-checking get away with... Uh, yeah, um, it was bad. All right, uh, scoring in the first was uh, Anthony Richard with his eighth with an assist from Mika Salabaki, his fifth. And then Richard scored again, his ninth with an assist from Alexander Carrier, his 16th, and Rem Pitlick, his ninth. Then Joey Lalegia scored his second of the year with an assist from Andreas Borgman, his eighth, and Tanner Kaspik, his fifth. I don't have to talk about the goalies right now because I can just jump right into three stars of the game to do that. Yeah. Um, third star of the game was Billy Huso, who was the goalie for the San Antonio Rampage. He stopped 23 and 25. Oh, okay. I was about to confuse myself for a second. Um, uh, second star of the game was Troy Grosnick. He stopped 23 and 24. First star of the game was Anthony Richard with two goals. Wow, that was actually pretty quick how you zipped through that. All right, um, head coach for the Admirals is Carl Taylor, assistant coach Scott Ford, assistant coach Greg Rollo, head coach for the San Antonio Rampage is Drew Bannister, assistant coach Jim Johnson, uh, assistant coach Daniel Kachuk. Uh, attendance was 4,001 at the UW Panther Arena. Referees were Mitch Dunning and Riley Yerkovich. Well, linesmen were Julian For, uh, Fournier and John Ray. Santini, Carr, and Davies are on Daniel's crap list. They all had a minus one. Actually, see, Santini's not. I saw him blocking a lot of shots, so I can't really get too mad at him. It all right, who's on your crap list? Not really anybody. They played well. It was just... Yeah, it was a good game. It was all Richard all the time, but it was a great game. I'm coming out to the Panther Arena this Friday night for the Anthony Richard bobblehead. They take on the Cleveland Monsters at 7 p.m. And don't worry, they're not that scary. No, they're not. <laughs> Also, uh, tomorrow, the uh, Nashville Predators take on the Ottawa Senators. Yes, this, if this ain't a victory, I don't I don't know if we could talk about the Predators anymore. Actually, Tell them how bad the uh, Senators are first before I break them down. The Senators have played 35 games. They have 14 wins, 18 losses, which is not great, not horrible. But right. They're like damn near at the bottom of the entire league. Actually, Detroit's got that one locked, stock, and barrel. Yeah, well, we're not talking about Detroit. We're talking smack about the Senators. Actually, Chicago's worse than they are. <laughs> and Blackhawk fans still think they deserve stuff, all because they don't live in a large market. Um, so, yeah, they're uh, 14, 18, and 3. Uh... They, in their last five, they're three, five, or the last ten, they're three, five, and two. They they lost in overtime to the Lightning, which means that if they're pushing good teams, eh, 
think you get it. But the Predators ain't the world's greatest team. So, are you going to consider the Predators a good team? Given Healthy, your lack yes. Of, uh, knowledge lately? Healthy, yes. Injured, no. Okay. They're, right. right now, they're pretty banged up. With Arvidsson on IR. But is Bradley. Arvidsson their only defenseman? Because last time I checked, there's multiple defensemen on a team. And this uh, Predator team, not really good on the defensive side. They've been getting better. Keyword, getting better. Uh, anyways, uh, for uh, the Senators, uh, line combinations, you got uh, Brady Kachuk, 11 goals, 8 assists. Uh, what is that? Jean Gabriel Pegua? Or Peugeot. Page, whatever. Peugeot. Uh, 16 goals, 8 assists for Pego. And then you got Connor Brown, 6 goals, 15 assists. Uh, then you got in their second line, uh, Anthony Duclair. He's the, he leads the team in points with 19 goals, 7 assists. Then you have Chris uh, Thurney. Or Tierney, uh, 15 assists, 4 goals. And then you got Vladislav Namist Namistikov. Yeah, him. Uh, 10 assists, 7 goals. As far as their defense goes, uh, they don't even have a defense. Like, everybody sucks. And I'm not even... Oh, correction. Thomas Shabbat is their best. So, I was about to say, how do you say Thomas Chabot sucks? He's like the best guy they got on the like team. Like I said, he's the best guy. Other than that, the rest of their defenders are crap. So if you don't beat the uh, Senators, Preds fans, yeah, you might have some issues with our coach. Other than that, there's really nobody that really scares me. All right, well, let me jump into this where we talk about the I goalies. I mean, Drake and Chucks and, uh, what is that, Pago or Pago? So, like literally, uh, Duclair to Kachuk and Pago, they're the three best guys on offense. Everybody else is like crack. And that's just my opinion. <laughs> the Senators should be a cakewalk to win. But that's their, if, they're, if the Preds are anything like us, if you're at the bottom of the division, you're going to beat us. Yeah. That's just how it works for us. Yeah. But I'm thinking that Predators should get this victory. I mean, it's... It's the Senators. I mean, All right. Well, they're starting goalie.